Shane Miles from MSA 4x4. Uh, tell us a little bit about these towing mirrors that uh, MSA's come up with. Okay, Dean, so what we've got here is, um, I've specifically designed a towing mirror to suit Australian vehicles. Um, there has previously been some other towing mirrors available on the market, but they're, they're really generally suited to a lot bigger trucks. So I've designed something specifically for our cars that look like they're supposed to be there. That was the number one. Yeah, this, factor. to me, this looks just, you know, slightly different shape, but not significantly larger than a standard 200 series mirror. So yeah. what, what's the go? How is it a towing mirror? Well, well, that's right. It is actually, you get a much better viewing angle, even in its standard position. It's slightly closer to the car, but it, as it looks like it's supposed to be there. So yeah. then what you do, okay, if you're towing something, or if you have a camper trailer or a, a tray back, ute or a, a horse float or something like that you can just okay, come out yeah. to the first towing position and we have little infill pieces as well that if you want to leave them out there all the time you can but they will stay out there they won't rattle in or out okay so, yeah so that then, gives you a lot wider angle it gives you, can you see a, past a lot wider viewing towing, yeah or? generally you've got to be able to see down the sides of what you're towing you've got to have a, a good view down to the back so and what if you got like a larger like a really big van or something yep okay so large vans um and like large boats and stuff there's a lot of american boats that people tow now that are like on the two and a half meter wide yeah so that's right on what the we do isn't it? is then we okay, rotate cool. out there so well, that's pretty easy. Um, that gives you a really good view down the back. There's a little actuator inside the body here that senses when it's rotated, so you can still use up and down, left, right with your mirror switches. Oh, so it won't get confused it when you're using your standard switch gear and no, stuff? That's correct. So it'll all work up and down, side to side. If you, your car's got indicators, we include those. Heating, yeah. uh, blind spot monitoring, GPS antennas. So oh, cool. It's got a got nice convex uh, glass on it too, it's doesn't got it? A, so it's got a slightly curved glass, not too much. It's, um, and we've only gone for a single glass. A, a lot of people find that the extra convex mirror that some have uh, a, a little bit confusing when reversing, especially. Yeah. Uh, so that single glass with a slight curve on it gives an awesome view all over. All right, fantastic. It really is a great view. So. Thanks, mate. That's all right, mate. And easy as that. Easy Pack as it that. away, it's back to standard. We, uh, we've given them a fair bashing, so if you do happen to... Uh, hit a tree or something like that, they'll go both ways. So. Well, you know I will. <laughs> so, it's all good, mate. Good on you, mate. That's awesome. No worries.